Hi viewers, welcome back. And today we're going to have a look at the anatomy of flexor carpi radialis muscle. So the flexor carpi radialis is this fusiform muscle of the superficial anterior compartment of forearm, also called the flexor compartment of forearm. And this muscle lies just lateral to the palmaris longus muscle. Now if we study the origin of the flexor carpi radialis muscle, so this muscle originates through the common flexor tendon from the medial epicondyle of the humerus. And after origin from the medial epicondyle, the tendon of origin forms a fusiform shaped muscle belly which travels inferolaterally towards the hand. And this muscle belly then inserts through a long tendon onto the palmar aspects of the bases of the second and third metacarpal bones. Now if we study the actions of the flexor carpi radialis muscle, so as its name suggests, this muscle is a flexor and it flexes the hand at the radiocorpal joint also called the wrist joint. And this muscle also abducts the hand at the radiocarpal and midcarpal joints. The flexor carpi radialis muscle receives its innervation from the median nerve. The median nerve arises from both the medial and lateral cords of the brachial plexus. And this nerve has got its nerve fibers arising from the 7th and 8th cervical spinal nerve roots. The flexor carpi radialis muscle receives its arterial supply from two arteries, the radial artery and the posterior ulnar recurrent artery. The posterior ulnar recurrent artery arises as a posterior branch from the ulnar artery. And the ulnar artery together with the radial artery arise as medial and lateral divisions of the brachial artery respectively. Now let's review all these points which we studied about the flexor carpi radialis muscle. So this muscle originates through the common flexor tendon from the medial epicondyle of the humerus. It inserts onto the palmar aspects of the bases of the second and third metacarpal bones. The innervation of this muscle, so this muscle receives its nerve supply from the median nerve. Its arterial supply, so this muscle receives its arterial supply from two arteries, the radial artery and the posterior ulnar recurrent artery. And this muscle performs two actions flexion of the hand at the radiocarpal joint and the abduction of the hand at the radiocarpal and midcarpal joints. So this was a tutorial on the flexor carpi radialis muscle. Hope you like this tutorial. Thank you so much.